Oh well, I'll put the Pokeballs in the items case. Pokeballs are used for catching Pokemon and carrying the Pokemon you catch. I'm gonna go on ahead. I'll be waiting for you in Accumula Town. Can I finally play? Well, I mean, this is nowhere near as bad as Hellsun and Moon did, where the whole fucking area, first area, is just the fucking tutorial, and it made me want to hang myself. She forgot to say that Pokemon jump out at you in the tall grass. Thanks for telling me that, Sharon. I'll head to Accumula Town, too. I think I'll go, too. I look forward to the next town. Wait a minute. Hey, listen, Noel Sharon, I thought about something fun. What? Well, we need to get going. The Battle of Professor is waiting for us, too. Would you just listen for a sec? Seriously. Why don't we see who can catch the most Pokemon? The person carrying the most Pokemon, including the one received from the Professor Juniper, is the winner. Huh. Actually, that sounds interesting. They'll fill up the Pokedex pages, so I'm sure it'll please the Professor, too. Okay. Then, until we reach a cubicle in town, take care of healing your Pokemon at your own house. Me and Debecky will do the best for sure. Oh. Uh, sure. Oh, it's a pause button. Whoops. Eh, I should probably look around. Maybe I can find a pit dove. Not a pack rat! A pack rat! I'm not even gonna waste time catching him. But dude, I haven't played Pokemon White in like since it came out. I don't even remember when it came out. 2010, 2011. Ugh. The span of 2008 to 2013 is a blur. Eh, I could use this time to battle. Ooh, I got a crit. Yay! Oshawawi is level 7! Oshawawi learned Water Gun. A wild Lil Pop! Or is it Lil. It's, I think it's Lily Pop? Lily Pop? Like Lollipop? Eh, who cares? Tail Whip! Water gun! Hose that dude down! Oh crap! Oh, it's a tackle! Oh no! Ah, I'm in so much danger! Ah. Now that's what I call a waterboarding. <laughs> Why is that fucking funny? <sighs> okay. Oshawabi gained 19 experience points. How about it, Noel? Did you compare who has the most? Yes. What? What? You only have Oshawa? If you don't catch anyone, won't Oshawa get lonely? Don't even get angry with me, Nick. I know. I know what I'm doing. I'm a Pokemon master. Oh, hi, hi. Hello. How is everybody doing? You and your Pokemon are getting really um, great along, right? I know that wasn't right. Uh, oh, Professor, right now I'm in front of Accumula Town's Pokemon Center. I'd like to show you around, so hurry on, everyone. Yeah, you know, the time you're taking to call me is time I can be taken to get there. Just saying. Just pointed that out. Well, I'ma go on ahead, cause I'm a edgy fuck- Wait, no wait, nope, that's the second version. That's you. It's not this guy. Let's check my Pokemon. And by that I just mean the one. Uh, how's he doing? Uh, how, how's Oshawawi doing? 
Uh huh. Uh huh. He has really uh, good special attack. I don't know if Water is a special attacking type. I am pretty stupid. So let's check. Oh, it is special. Sweet. When can I run? Oh, I love this song though. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just thinking of the furret meme. The furret meme? Whatever it's called. Ah, Noelle, there you are. Traveling with your Pokemon is truly one of the joys of being a trainer. Please follow me. I like to show you those important things for a trainer to know. This is single-handedly the greatest function they ever added in a Pokemon game. Combining the Pokemart with the Poke fucking... I forgot what it was called. Poke Center? Pokemon Center? Is that what they call it? Pokemon Center. Yeah. Yeah, got it. Woo. <sighs> Don't you feel better as soon as you step through the door? Okay, let's start at your tour. Don't talk to me. Oh, oh, wait for me. Ah, Pokemon Center is a truly incredible place. You know why? Because your Pokemon can get healed. So we can it will absolve you of all the guilt and pain that you put your Pokemon through through battling. <laughs> And what's more, it's absolutely free. Free healthcare. <laughs> Write that down. A Pokemon Center is a trainer's best friend. Here, Noel, give it a try. Haha, <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm kidding. Okay, I'll do it. It was a joke. Hey, Noel, where are you off to? You remember me and take the lady, talk to the lady. Fine, I hate talking to people. Hello, welcome to the Pokemon Center. We restore your Pokemon to full health. Would you like us to restore your Pokemon to full health? Yes. Just just heal Oshawawi. Thank you for waiting. We've restored your Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. Oh yeah. Now that your Pokemon have rested, I'll show you how to use the PC at the Pokemon Center. Oh god, <laughs> this whole session is just for tutorial. Uh, they should have had an option saying, Do you know how to play a Pokemon game? Yes! Okay, yep, PC, that's where you can get your Pokemon that'll save your party, yada yada yada. It says someone's PC on the screen. Who is someone? Oh, actually, that's a valid question. Very good, Bianca. That's a great observation. Good, good question. I'd like to say more, but for now, just ignore that and go ahead and use it. Yeah, I'd actually like to know what that was about, because like, someone is the person who made the Pokemon Sword system. Someone I'm sure you'll meet someday. Okay, let's move on. That, that's whack. Now, this is the Pokemart. This is the place to buy useful items to sell the ones you don't need anymore. That gentleman over there will help you with a smile as he constantly figures out how he's an essential worker. I'll give you the basics of being a Pokemon trainer. One final thing, when you get to str what? How do you even pronounce that? Striated? 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 I think Striated. Is it Striated? Striated? I'm gonna say Striated. Striated City, go and an adventure named Fennel. She's a friend of mine from long ago, and I'm sure she'll help you on your way. Best of luck, I hope your journey proves to be the adventure of a lifetime. Bye. Bianca Shaw. Oh, who? What should I buy? Potions and Pokeballs are definitely important. I'm uh, thinking. I'ma let you airhead. Hello, may I help you? I have four hundred dollars. Damn, my mom hooked me up. Wait, no shit. Wait a minute, this is yen. That means four thousand dollars is forty bucks, which means the Pokeball's two bucks. Damn, those are some cheap ass potions. Potion, you want five? That'll be a that'll be fifteen dollars. <sighs> Sounds like something's going something's going on in the plaza. Well, let's have a look see. Oh boy, is this the plasma guy? It's my boy N! Oh well, come here a second. Man, I don't care about politics. Oh, this fuckhead. Oh, oh, 
My name is Getsu. I am here representing Team Plasma. This song is a jam, by the way. Today, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to talk to you about Pokemon Liberation. Huh? What? Can someone tell me what the heck is going on? Gets this. I'm sure most of you believe that we humans and Pokemon are partners that have come to live together because we want and need each other. I assure you that is far from the case. However, is that really the truth? Have you ever considered that perhaps we humans only assume that this is the truth? Fuck science! <laughs> this is a religion, bitch! <laughs> Pokemon are subject to the selfish commands of trainers. That's why my men all use Pokemon that we stole from other people. <laughs> they get pushed around when they are our partners at work. Can anyone say with confidence that there is no truth in what I'm saying? No way, yikes. I don't know. Now, ladies and gentlemen, Pokemon are different from humans. They are living beings that contain unknown potential that I want to use and exploit to destroy and control the world. Uh, they are living beings from whom we humans have much to learn. I'm have, okay, I guess this is going to be fun to voice, if I, I'm going to stick with that. Tell me, what is our responsibility towards these wonderful beings called Pokemon? What can it be? Liberation. <laughs> That's right! We must liberate the Pokemon! Everyone, give me your Pokemon! <laughs> then you'll all be defenseless and I can do what I want. Then, and only then, will human and Pokemon truly be equals. Well, I mean, until the Pokemon can fucking say their name, like the goat that is Meowth from Team Rocket, I, I don't think they're equal. They're not even fucking sentient. <laughs> just saying. Just saying. Except for some. Looking at you, Mewtwo. Everyone, I end my words here today by imploring you to consider the relationship between people and Pokemon and the correct way to proceed. We sincerely appreciate your attention. About that speech, what do you think we should do? I'm gonna liberate Pokemon. That's not even possible. 